Hello, my Bill for the House of Nation. How's everyone doing today? Hopefully, everyone's having a great day. If not, I hope it gets better from here. We are back with another watcher. This one is titled, Are You Scared of Kisaragi? Kiss 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 Are you scared of Kisaragi? Kiss Kiss Kisaragi Station? Kisaragi Station? I butchered the shit out of that. Yep. I'm excited for today's story. If you guys are excited as I am, go ahead. Turn them lights down low. Put on something comfy. Couple something special. Let's get spooky. Mainly because I don't know what the fuck I just said. I'm Ryan Bergara. This is Are You Scared? A show where I tell my friend, Shane Madej, the internet's scariest stories. So lock your doors, turn off the lights, and let's see if we can make it till the end of the night. Kisaragi Station. Kisaragi. Kisaragi. Publisher's note. This was an actual thread from 2010 on 2chan, a Japanese image board. The thread was translated and compiled for easier reading by VG person. It began in the middle of a thread called Post About Strange Occurrences Around You, Thread 26. For your convenience, the responses from the original thread creator have been labeled Hasumi, but please note that the poster originally started as anonymous before revealing their name later in the thread. Conversely, Anon indicates a post made by any other 2chan user. They are not all the same person. By all indications, the responses in the thread were happening in real time as the user described their situation. Okay. Please enjoy the thread. I love a story that starts out with, this is definitely real. I well, swear. they never claimed it was real. They claimed it was an actual thread. Okay. Maybe think critically for once. Excuse me? <laughs> <laughs> Try and think critically. Before we hop into this one, just want to say that we're going to be doing this episode a little bit different because this is an actual conversation. I'm not going to be able to do uh, the voices of both people. So we're going to have somebody come in for Hasumi. You're going to be hearing a female voice. Now that the table is set, let's get into the scene. Oh boy. This may just be my imagination. Can I post it anyway? Go ahead. What's going on? I've been riding a certain train for a while, but something seems off. Hmm. Well, I always take this train to work, but it hasn't stopped at any of the stations for the past 20 minutes or so, and it usually only takes five minutes, seven or eight at worst. Oh, and there's five other passengers, but they're all sleeping. Did you take the express train by mistake? Is it a high-speed train? Well, it's possible I may have just missed my stop, but it doesn't look like I'm on the express train. I'll wait a little longer. If anything else strange occurs, eh, I might just bring it up here. Try going to the car on the end to see the conductor, maybe? It would be really bad if the driver had an epileptic fit or something. You should check on the conductor. Still no sign of stopping. So, all right, I'll take a look. Four minutes pass. There were blinds or something covering the window, so I couldn't see the conductor or the driver. The route is a private railway in Shizuoka. I miss trains. Trains are fun. They are fun. I love trains. Fun. <laughs> this is banter. It's fun to ride yeah. a train. Any guesses on what she just saw? <laughs> I guess in my mind, I'm imagining sort of um, a Tom Hanks-ish type director, you know, conductor. We're in Japan. I'm, for some reason, I still have Tom Hanks in my head, I, and I hmm. don't know why. Oh my Paul, God, I know what you're freaking doing, dude. Paul We're Paul not going to talk about Polar Express. Choo choo, the whistle blows. That's the sound of her breathing. I think it'd be kind of cool if we found out this train was uh, conducted by nobody, a ghost train. You now go that's up there, scary. And the levers are just moving on their own. Yeah. Oh, what's that one movie? Meat Train. Weird ass fucking movie. What if it's something like that? Yeah. Choo choo, more like boo. Ooh! Knock on the window? I tried that, but nobody answered. Can you see out the window? Names of stations you're passing, etc. We came out of tunnels, so we're dropping speed slightly. There usually aren't any tunnels, though. It's a train from Shin Hamamatsu. What do you see? You still there? Looks like we're finally stopping at a station. You aren't going to get off there, are you? 
at this point, it's okay. clear yeah. at the very least, in best case scenario, you have gotten on the wrong train. Yeah. I'm not immediately like, I'm on a terror train right now. A hell train. Yeah. That too. You could do that. Hell train, terror train. Mine's got alliteration going for it. A spooky choo-choo. A spooky choo-choo. A boo-choo. A boo-choo. I like that. I like spooky choo-choo. You shake on that, boo-choo. Spooky boo-choo. choo-choo. I'll tell you what. Spooky my first go-to here would be oh, to Lord. wake everybody up on the train. You're yeah. going to be like, I got on the wrong train. I got on the wrong. No, I'd be very polite about it. Pretend to be asleep. Okay. I'd do the gentle, excuse me, sir? <laughs> sir? Mm. Uh, Hello, I'm riding this train with you. I don't know where we are. Where are we going? Answer me! It's a white it's man. Like, just like that. <laughs> it's a white it's man. It's a white man. We're stopped at Kisaragi <laughs> Station. Never heard of this place before. Definitely check it out. No, stay on until the last stop. Oh, but it's probably already departing now. When did you get on the train? I've gotten off the train. The station's unmanned. I believe I got on the train at 20.05. I'm not finding any information on Kisaragi Station. And Hasumi, your train was going for over an hour? That's really strange. Yeah, I'm not getting any results for Kisaragi Station. I'm looking for a schedule so I can get back, but I can't find one. The train is still stopped, so it'd probably be safest to get back on. Well, it left while I was writing that. Is there anyone nearby? Or any buildings? It's cold out, so be careful. I'll look for a taxi from the station. Thank you very much. Sounds good. Take care. You get off at a train stop you've never heard of. You don't know where you are. You don't know if there's another train coming through. At least if you're on the train, if it goes to the end of the line, you can be like, hey, take me somewhere, please. What if it's a train that never stops? That's not a real thing. You're way past the last train at an unmanned station. Really questionable if you'll have any luck finding a taxi there. Right. And so, Hasumi became an inhabitant of the two-dimensional world. Two minutes pass. There doesn't seem to be any taxis anywhere. Hmm. Call 110? But by the way, 110 is 911, yeah. Call the taxi company? If there's a telephone booth nearby, look up the taxi company in the phone book and call. I know I said this before, but I don't know why. I think every place is 911. I'm like, why are you calling 110? It... <laughs> oh, man. Like, if anything ever, if I do ever go somewhere other than where I'm already at and I have an emergency, I'm fogged. Three minutes pass. I called home and asked to be picked up, but neither of my parents seem to know where Kizaragi Station is. They'll look for it on the map so they can come get me. But I'm getting a little scared now. What about the others? Are you the only one who got off the train? I checked online too, and the name Kizaragi Station isn't coming up. Am I wrong in assuming it's around Shin Hamamatsu? I'll check Yahoo. You'll check Yahoo? Yeah. Might as well be dead. At I that was about point. to say, who's checking right. fucking Yahoo? If my life depends on someone checking Yahoo, yeah, he might as well be saying, "I'll ask Jeeves." <laughs> right. I'll Rip check, to that guy. Let me let me check Bing. I'm just getting word that Yahoo is huge in Japan and that we're being oh. big d bags. Oh, okay. More power to you, Japan. No one else got off, so I'm alone now. It's definitely <laughs> oh, called Kizaraki. Bizarre. Are you a gaming nerd? Because a game comes up if you Google it. Tell us the names of the stations before and after Kisaragi. What do you mean, a game? It doesn't say what the next and previous stations are. There's no station map? That doesn't make sense. Walk back along the track. If you start running now, you might catch up to the train. There must be houses around the station, right? Yes, there are. I didn't quite notice since I was panicking. I'm waiting for my parents to call while walking along the track. I tried checking town information on iMode, but it gave me a point error or something. I just want to go home. Seems like maybe a bad idea to heed the advice of strangers on the internet. They're telling her to walk along the train tracks alone late at night. I mean, I probably would have done that too, though. No! Well, what else are you going to do? Here's the thing. You, we c- keep opting for worse and worse scenarios. Should have stayed on the train, 
got off at the station. I disagree. The, sh- the train could be going to hell, and now okay, you're only halfway to hell. Okay, the train could be going to hell. Now you're at a station, vulnerable, in the middle of nowhere, but still, I would take the lights of a train station, you know, sort of an enclosed space, over walking down the train tracks alone in the middle of the night. Trains go through, like, forests You would be stuff. going through a tunnel, though. Do you think that these anonymous contributors to this conversation, do you think any of them are in on it? Are, are nasty? Ill intentions? I think some of them might want to see what Ooh, happens that's a if this person question. gets off. Yeah. Like it's excited, this is 2chan after all, they might be excited True. by the uh, the prospect that someone could be walking into the depths of hell. It's possible. Things well, can get pretty fucked she up got on 2chan. Off. That's what happened. Tell us what you're seeing. Hello? Are you okay? There was nothing around here. All I saw were fields and mountains, so I turned around and walked back towards the station into the tunnel where I came from. I'll keep pushing on. Thank you very much. Treat this as a joke, if you will. But can I come to you if I encounter any more trouble? Of course. Don't get lost and be careful in the tunnel. Sure. Just make sure you don't run out of battery. Your phone's your lifeline right now. I kind of think you shouldn't stray far from the station. All alone on a cold night at a station with I no like attendance. How this is going, man. I'm Soon the lights could go out and it'll be pitch black. Not really helpful, Anon. Oh, geez, this sounds bad. I got a call from my father and he had many questions but simply couldn't find my location. I've been told to call 110, which <laughs> I'm a little opposed to doing, but I'll try asking them to help me now. I really think you should wait until it gets lighter out before you do anything. Lameo, <laughs> why would she wait till light to call the police, dude? Obviously call the police. I meant don't stray far from the station. Waiting all alone in the dead of night? And in some ominous place? Yikes. I called 110 and tried my absolute best to explain the situation, but they thought it was all a joke and got angry at me. So Sounds I about right. got scared and apologized. Inside the tunnel now. That sounds like me. You immediately have any kind of opposition and you're like, my bad. I'm sorry. <laughs> Hi. Yeah. Uh, so I think I'm maybe trapped in hell. It, could you sit? Uh, you're Where? right. I'm sorry. Where are you? Where? I think I'm in hell. Okay. Any more information? It's a train station okay, that might this be This is hell? a serious line. We don't take prank calls lightly here, I'm sir. sorry. You're right. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. You sound like a little baby. Do- you sound like a little baby boy. Do you forgive me, daddy? <laughs> Lol, classic. Should probably give up for today. Go back to the station and wait for the first train. I hear what sounds like a beating drum mixed with some kind of bell way off in the distance. Honestly, I have no idea what to do at this point. Get back to the station for now, Hasumi. Here's where it gets going. Are they having a festival or what? You might think I'm kidding, but I'm too scared to look behind me. I do want to go back to the station, but I don't dare turn around. Run, and don't look back. You can't go back to the station now. Run through the tunnel. I'm sure you'll find you're not far. Someone behind me yelled, Hey, don't walk on the track, that's dangerous. I looked around expecting to see an attendant and saw a one-legged old man. But now he's not there. I think I'm too scared to move. I would go and befriend that man. What? So let's just get this straight. You're in a- Get it straight. You're in a tunnel. Yeah. You're in a tunnel on, on a train track near no station. Right. And there's an old man there. Yes. Inexplicably, who has one leg. Well, he and uh, who knows what happened to it. He probably lost it in the war. It's probably not inexplicable. He knows on what the train happened tracks. to it. Maybe that's why he's like, you shouldn't walk on the train tracks. It's dangerous. He didn't just wake up and was like, where's my leg? Obviously, inexplicable in the sense that there's an old man with one leg oh, in the tunnel with gotcha. you. I'm sure, sure there's sure. an explanation sure. for why he has one yes. leg. It's weird that he's in the tunnel in the middle of nowhere. Well, it's also weird that she's in the tunnel in the middle of nowhere. Yeah, but he doesn't- He's str- probably freaked the hell out. He's like, oh, you a th- spooky girl? I got a question before we get into it. You think this tunnel's gonna end? Or now do you think it's tunnel time onto eternity? I certainly hope not, because I hate the idea of being, I get claustrophobic, so being trapped in a tunnel for eternity sounds like a fucking nightmare. Maybe that is hell. Maybe she is in hell and she deserved this because she was a bad person. You know, this actually sounds like a very special form of purgatory. It's a tunnel, Ooh. yeah. but at the end, you do see the tiniest little box of light. So you think 
you're going to get out. But you never get there. No matter how fast you walk or run towards it. That is absolutely fucked. That's fucked up, right? Yeah. You're a master of nice terror. Stroll. I told you not to look back. Run. Calm down and listen to Big Bro, okay? Check out where the drum's coming from. There's bound to be somebody playing it. Where the hell are you planning to take Hasumi? I can't walk or run any further. The drumming sound is getting a little closer. This sounds like Jumanji. Yo, what if this is Jumanji, bro? What if it's Wait just for a train? dawn. It won't be scary in the daylight. Uh, I'm glad I stayed on the train. Not the time to joke, Anon. I'm still alive, but I fell and started bleeding, and I broke a heel, so I'm sitting still on the ground. I don't want to die now. Oh, shit. It should be safe once you're out of the tunnel. Once you get out of there, call for help immediately. I called home. Dad's calling the police, but the sound keeps getting closer. I hope to God that's not the sound of a train. Twelve minutes pass. I finally managed to make it to the front of the tunnel, not as long as I thought. There's a sign that says there's a station nearby. The name says Izanuki. The sound's still getting closer, so I'm going to leave the tunnel. If I'm safe once I get out of the tunnel, I'll post again. Good luck. This is the end. Forget about trains and stations. Forget about going back. Forget about someone chasing you. The sound you're hearing is just something you imagined. Run out of the tunnel. If you stop, you'll only succumb to something which does not belong in this world. <laughs> Lol. What? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, same. I like that. <laughs> Though that would be me. I'd be what? trying to poke as many holes in this story as possible and try to really, really push I mean, it along. Maybe I want that to push person knows something what that if no you one didn't else push knows. This person who was actually in this situation into death. Um, I guess I wouldn't feel responsible for it. I, <laughs> well, no, that's true. That's true. I would mostly assume that it was. They didn't follow your directions. Fault, you know. Oh, okay. Just the devil up to his tricks. If there's anybody to pass the. It's not my fault. I, I, look, I put the plate in front of them. It is however they get there. So, I mean, you know, do we blame the lab rat that's going through the maze to get the cheese if he falls into a pit of spikes? No, you just put him in the maze and you put the cheese on the other end and he chose his own fate. Buck to you. The, the devil's devil. a good candidate, yeah. which, as you know, will be me soon. You're just going to be murdering people and you'll be like, it's the devil's fault. <laughs> I left Satan. the tunnel and there's someone up ahead and it looks like all your advice was right after all. Thank you so much. <sighs> My face is such a mess from tears. He might just mistake me for a monster. Wait, Hasumi, don't die on us. Stop. That can't be good. Someone there? This late at night? That's suspicious. He seems gentle and he was worried for me. He called for a train to take me to the next station over towards home. Apparently there's some kind of business hotel there. <laughs> I'm truly, truly thankful to all of you. Hasumi, please answer me this one thing. Can you ask that man what that place is? Is he really gentle? He sounds kind of scary from what you said. That guy's no good. Why is he by the track at this hour? He must have been a corpse or something. Hasumi, run. Four minutes pass. I asked him where it was, and he said Hina. That seems extremely unlikely, though. On the train now. Hasumi, get off the train. Excuse me, Hasumi? Where's Hina? Nine minutes pass. We've been headed towards the mountains for some time, and it really doesn't strike me as a place where trains would go. And he stopped talking to me entirely. Probably because you're constantly messing with your phone. No good. Now he's no good. Now he's a gentle creep. He's on the train. He's not talking to her. He's going to a place that also sounds made up. Yeah. Mm. I guess she's been on the train with this guy Man. for nine minutes. I'm liking Classic how they're doing stuff. the story. I've been on the train for nine minutes. That's I'm true. I guess very... that's not weird. That doesn't mean immediately like, oh, I'm going to hell. I spend nine minutes Love on it. a train all the time. I've seen you spend Love nine minutes it. on the toilet. You know? Yeah. Also not abnormal. Right? Um... <laughs> <laughs> It's not a good situation. I mean, if, if, if she is going to hell, she's really being toyed with here. Well, but isn't that the devil's favorite thing? That is Toying with humans like his little playthings. Huh? Like a cat and mouse <laughs> game. <laughs> you gotta play with your food. That's yeah. the devil with his little uh, <laughs> human marionettes. Dance, my little sets of bones. Asumi, oh no, no. Did you contact your parents after you got out of the tunnel and received aid from this guy? Asumi, please call 110. This might be your last chance. My battery is almost run out. Things are getting strange, so I think I'm gonna make a run for it. 
He's been talking to himself about bizarre things for a while now. To prepare for just the right time. I'm gonna make this my last post for now. Afterward, Hasumi was never heard from again. So, are you scared? Yeah. I so, like is she that. dead? <laughs> Does she get eaten by mountains? I don't know. Is that man. it? I think she, uh, yeah, she got swallowed in the bowels of that train monster. I'd love to know what she did bad, you know, what, what she'd done, if she deserved this in any way, you know, if she is a, like a bigot or her, um... I'd like to think she did nothing wrong. Okay. And that sometimes fate just chooses because. You'd love to think that she did nothing wrong and just a perfectly innocent person, uh got on a hell train. Isn't it horrible? I don't, don't know. Don't trust trains? I, I, Is that the morals? I don't know. Stop that, taking trains. I think if that's what you want to take away from this. No that, more that, trains. That could be that. Well, if you like that story, no surprise here, that is written by an anonymous user, AKA Hasumi. So if you're out there, Hasumi, and this is a real story, I hope you just goofed and got on the wrong train. Assuming right. you're alive. <laughs> Give us a shout out, let us yeah, know how you're doing. that's good, that's good. I really hope she's not dead after that situation. joke. Yes. Um, Assuming you're dead, uh, uh, then rest in peace in hell. Well, that does it for this episode of Are You Scared? Next time you get on a train. That was fucking amazing. I like how they did the storytelling where everybody was just kind of like, wow, 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 wow. Love that. Man, if y'all enjoyed today's story as much as I did, please go down and leave a thumbs up. It really helps the channel grow more than anything other than if you want, you can go on over and slap that subscribe button, become part of the Bill 5000 Nation. That helps it grow too. And if you want to be a part of the Bill 5000 Nation so bad, you can go on over to Discord, the B5 Nation over there, and become a member over there as well. You can even be a supporter of the channel if you want. And as always, oh, and if you'd really like, you can ding that bell. It might work for you, it might not, but if it do, if it do, jump in on one of my premieres and be like, hey, Bill, your ding came in low and slow. Loved it. I'm going to be like, well, it's not supposed to do that, but hell's yeah. Leave a like and dip. That's all you got to do. As always, be good to one another. I'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye. Damn.